What's up, everyone? It's Jonathan with Bay Area Throwbacks, and I got a unique, um, don't know if it's game used, but it's at least team issued a uh, batting practice jersey from a um, former pitching coach of the Giants. I don't really get uh, coach jerseys. I think this is my first one. I mean, my Evans jerseys are Lefty Odu, who was technically a manager of the Seals, but um, he also played during those years, so he was kind of a player manager. So, this is, if I'm not mistaken, my first jersey that's fully a, just a coach. So, um, he was a pitcher in the major leagues, had a solid career as a pitcher. I think I just said pitcher. Anyways, um, did throw a no-hitter for the Yankees against the Red Sox. Also pitched for the Giants and A's, so barrier connections there. And born in San Jose, went to high school in San Jose, so grew up in San Jose, so more Bay Area connections. And for anyone who says San Jose is not the Bay, uh, it is. There's nine counties in the Bay. San Jose is one of them. It is the Bay Area, no matter what you say. It's a fact, not a question. So, anyways, it is none other than Mr. Dave Bergetti himself. Um, who was also the pitching coach from 2000 and 2017 for the Giants. He was the first pitching coach I watched as a kid, being a fan starting in 2001. He pitched, uh, he was a pitching coach for all four of those Giants World Series during the 2000s, including the three they won, 10, 12, and 14. So, solid. So, again, I grew up watching this guy, you know, come out of the mound, or come out to the mound for visits and all that, and uh, all the way through, you know, 2017. So, solid 18-year pitching coaching career with the Giants. So, this jersey, um, shout out my guy Joey Beckham. He sent me this, uh, or he sent me the, the link to it. And I was looking like, if, if I can find pictures of this, then I'll get it. Because I was able to get it for only 70 bucks with tax and shipping. I mean, after tax shipping, it was like 85 and change. So, good price. And I was luckily looking on Getty Images. I was able to find, um, only in 2000, I was able to find pictures of Jeff Kent and Dusty Baker wearing these. Um, before uh, the division, uh, division division series game against the Mets in 2000, um, I was able to find a picture of Ryan Vogelsong wearing it in the background of like a practice during 2000. Yes, he was on the Giants back then, part of the trade for Jason Schmidt. In case you didn't know that, then came back to the Giants later in his career. So, picture of him, and then I saw some uh, like picture day pictures from 2000 spring training of Marvin Menard and Ellis Burks with this on. So, you don't see it much, um, but they did wear it now. If David Getty ever wore it, I don't know, which is why I don't know if this is game used. But like I said, it is at least team issued. David Getty was number 19 that year. So that's what would make it his. So uh, it is one of those, uh, you know, like quarter zipper. It only goes up to here with, which I will show you, with the sleeves. One of those sleeves kind of like with the elastic bottom. Um, lately, uh, Mitchell Ness has been dropping some of the like 90s versions of these style batting practice jerseys that some of the teams had or maybe they all did i don't know but <coughs> anyways that's it so we're gonna do some uh i'll do some close-ups here close-ups over there and then we'll see so if you look right there you got that triple layered giants in the black over orange over gold got the mesh zipper you got that old school, majestic, authentic. Yeah, Russell Athletic make the jerseys at these times, but like the BP and uh, spring training jerseys and stuff were worn, were made by uh, Majestic, size 48. Looks like there's a 19 Sharpie in there, which would be the number. Uh, what else we got? On um, the back, 2000 was the first year that they started adding the Batterman logo on the jersey. So there you go. You got the collar with black, orange, gray, and then again, black, gray, Orange, black. Sleeves, same thing. There you go. Oh, uh, what else? Again, you got triple layered in the back. Black, orange, and gold. 19. Uh, let's see. You got the sleeves. Right side, uh, majestic. Like rubberized majestic across. I've also seen Barry Bonds in like this style of jersey, but his was like a, was a long sleeve. So I have seen that. So maybe they had different forms. But like I said, the one I saw, Baker, Kent, uh, Bernard, Burks, and Vogelsong was this one. Um, let's see. On the inside, we do have the tag right there, which you could barely see what's left, but it does say XL. Don't know if you could see it well. XL, and it's a number... 
0567, I think, made in USA. When the numbers usually have a zero in front of it, that means it's, um, most of the times it means it was issued to the team. So there you go. And again, when you have a jersey that's so like rare like this, they usually don't make retail authentics of it. So usually when you find these old school BP jerseys, um, they're usually either gamers or at least team issued. So I'm gonna bring this over to the other room, do some closer, um, what do you call it? Closer uh, footage of it. So those of you who say my handshake, you probably skip through that so you don't get a you know, headache or whatever. So here's the bottom. We got that elastic, stretchy bottom. Oh, where's my wash tag? And this being so washed so much, it's almost all white now, which means either it was worn or it means whoever bought this before me or whoever had this before me that I bought it from wore it a lot. I'm trying to see, man, you can't, oh, my bad, I'm tripping. There you go. There's zero, five, six, one or seven, one of them, XL, polyester, main USA. Got the pockets, both sides, with that rubberized Majestic. Some of this came off, it looks like. There you got that Giants across the chest. Pattern on the bottom of the sleeve. Same as around the collar, neck right here. Got your majestic embroidery right there. On the left sleeve, authentic majestic diamond collection, size 48. That 19 in Sharpie. Come to the back, first year Batterman logo. Even that looks a little faded, that orange. And you got that, got that triple stacked black, orange, and gold in the back. And again, the, the colors on this do look like there's been use, but again, it could have just been the perfect, the person who had this before me or multiple people just wearing it a lot and washing it a lot. So, you know, there you go though. Check the front one more time, and then I'm gonna throw it on. There you go. So here it is, size 48 XL. Um, it's great. Uh, got this right here, pockets if I need it, which is kind of cool. Um, you got the net, which does go up kind of high. Almost feels like a, a one of those the sun visor. What's it called? Sun visor? Whatever sun collars, whatever they call them, the like super old wool jerseys. Can open it up if I need to. Close it up if I need to. Comfortable, like I said, comfortable. You got that elastic bottom, you got the pockets. Match, kind of a chill jersey, you know? Something you can be comfortable in if you want something light. That, uh, yeah, just a comfortable piece of clothing, to be honest. So, there you go. 2000 San Francisco Giants BP slash spring training. I guess spring training BP, because they didn't wear these in games in spring training, but um, Dave Rigetti. Pitching coaching, pitching coach jersey. Either team issued or game used. Hopefully one day I can find a clip from 2000, you know, whether it's on video or a picture of him actually wearing this. And maybe I can photo match it. Who knows? But for now, I'll call it team issued. And it is what it is. You all have a good day. I'll see you next time. Peace.